All right, y'all. Um, a little bit ago, I got my very first, um, not my first bow or hand drill coal, but the first one using the floating method, where you just stay at the top and you just float. Um, my hands are getting kind of sore, but I'm gonna try this one more time to try to get it on video. Um, this is really cool because I've been trying this for a long time and I've been unsuccessful. And what I'm finding is that it works a whole different muscle group than the standard, you know, working your way down the spindle. That seems to work more of your shoulders and your upper arms, whereas floating seems to work more of your wrists and your forearms. Um, but I'm going to give it a go and see if I can't get um, a coal again from floating. So I've got a new debit card band because the set is not the greatest. Um, I'm using a semi-green horseweed spindle because it's all I've got right now. I've got some new ones but they're nowhere near dry. Um, this spindle has been um, drying for about three weeks maybe. Um, and uh, the ones I got now are less than a week old so they're nowhere and they're golden rods they're not horseweed so um, which I'm interested in trying those. Um, what I'm doing right now is I'm kind of, I had to clean up the end of my spindle and I grind it on the concrete to kind of smooth everything out and make it to where it doesn't chip out on me. I just carved in my divot. You see I've been practicing a lot. Um, this is a piece of willow. Um, and this is, this is my spindle here. It's uh, a piece of, you can see it's kind of green. It's a uh, horseweed. And, uh, so we're going to give this a go. I'm going to go ahead and burn in and then we'll start floating. I'm having trouble getting decent grip. But I am getting lots and lots of calluses. getting a callus right here and it kind of burns right now so we're burned in go ahead and cut my notch my notch is as clean and smooth as possible so that my coal doesn't hang up in it and um we'll kind of go from there now i've just got a piece of cardboard here that i'm going to use as my hearth board or my um coal catcher Scoot back a little bit so you can actually see me floating. And I've just got this pad so that my ankle has something to sit on because otherwise it's sit bare concrete. Here we go. Yeah. Just gotta scoot back just a little more. What I try to do is just get into a groove. I need to adjust my notch real quick because I'm getting more dust on the outside than I am in my notch.
we go. Okay, here we go. There we go, I'm getting much better dust. And I've got a cool. And you can see that this is not a new skill by any means. It's new to me. Um, I've been practicing with this for a long time. And I've just, I would get to a point where, where I'm floating and then I would just automatically just start going down without thinking about it. Um, and it's just a skill I've wanted. Um, it's just one more step in the, in the hand drill process that I really want. Um, And then a cool. Um, you can see it smoking there. Um, got another one. Um, I'm gonna have to lay off it for a little bit because my hands are really starting to hurt. And normally my hands don't hurt with this, but one of the things that I'm noticing is that my hands are riding right up on the top of the spindle and it's kind of digging in in certain spots. So like right in here and right in here. But I did get two coals just now. But uh, yeah, so that's that's the floating technique. Um, I'm by no means any kind of an expert on this stuff, but it's just really exciting for me. It's it's like the first time I got my coal. I was crazy excited, and then every time after that, it was it was like yeah, cool. I got a coal, yeah. And now it's like wow, that's cool. I just got a coal by floating. It's like doing it all over again. Um, and um, one thing that floating will let me do is use a lot shorter spindles. Like this spindle here is pretty short. Um, it's about the length of my forearm. And um, I mean, that's a lot of work trying to get down to the bottom and then have to come back up every time. It, you have to go crazy fast. Um, but this, allow, this allows me to get a coal with floating. Um, it's really cool. But yeah, that's the floating thing. And uh, let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.